Hello, and welcome to the corner of the house where I'm allowed to keep my things. My name is Joe. I am in the Christmas spirit. Got my Santa hat on. And I've got the pro wrestling crate for December of 2022. So I'm very excited. So let's get this thing opened up. I hope there's a, I hope there's a Christmas something or other in here. I, I would be, uh, I'd be excited by that. Uh, speaking of that, uh, the last video I did was pro wrestling loot, where I got a uh, fairy horror with Yamaka. And uh, uh, William in my comments for that video had said that I should wear it, and I put a lot of thought into it. And I put it on, and I looked ridiculous, and I didn't really feel comfortable. I didn't really feel comfortable wearing it uh, and making fun of it, I guess, or making fun of myself in it. So uh, I, I, I'm wearing my ridiculous Cleveland Cavs Santa hat instead. So I hope that's an appropriate uh, substitution. Uh, also, uh, Arlene commented and in, uh, in the last video and told me a little bit about uh, Barry Horowitz. So. Uh, They've commented a few times, and I always appreciate the info, so thank you for that. Let's get into this. What do we got? We got a spoiler card, so we'll put that over here. We do have something that's uh, Christmas-related. I see a shirt on top. So, what do we got? Oh, no, it's another major figure podcast shirt uh, it, it's neat it's a christmas story uh parody um if you're not familiar with the major wrestling figure podcast it's uh matt cardona uh brian myers hornswoggle uh they do uh they collect action figures and they they do uh you know videos uh where they go uh action figure hunting that kind of thing what does it say? A tribute to the original, most professional, always ready, silver ball, middle fingered, figtastic Christmas. Well, you know, I, I I will wear this at Christmas, so I'm very happy. I've got something to wear on Christmas that's wrestling related, so. And I got something Christmas, Christmassy in the box, so I'm happy about that. Uh, I'll wear it probably once and then retire it forever. Maybe, maybe next Christmas. Uh, there's a pin here, so I'll get that next. Oh, this is kind of cool. We got the Lucha Bros. It's like, um, I think they call them maybe chibi, chibi figures or something. Um, it's a cool looking pin. I love the Lucha Bros. Former AEW champions. Uh, Trio's champion with uh, a Pac right now. That is a cool pin. I like that a lot. Oh, I'm gonna pop it right up here on my pin board. There we go. All right, we have another shirt. Let's see what we got. We got a cowboy shot, Hangman Page, <laughs> since 2009. It's a pretty cool, uh, pretty cool shirt. I like that. Uh, it's it's like um. I don't think it's black. I'm blue, black, colorblind, so I could be wrong, but I think it's a dark blue. Uh, so it's a little bit of a different color. I like the, the, the design. Uh, it's a cool shirt. That's a cool shirt. Not bad. I like that. I don't know. I don't think I had a Hangman Page shirt, so so that's that's extra cool. Micro Brawler, we got Ultimo Dragon. Check that out. Pretty cool. I like Ultimo Dragon. It's a cool looking uh, micro brawler too. I like that. Very cool. Oh, let's see. We got some socks. Oh, I love. I I love. Oh, great. I love Super Kick socks. Um. Hope I'm not making too much noise on the microphone. I love super cuck, uh, super cuck. <laughs> super kicks, super kicks. That's the word I was looking for. Uh, I don't know what other word I was using there, uh, but I love super kick socks. I wear them all the time. 
uh, the previous ones. We've got the Godfather. We've got the Young Bucks. We got uh, Eddie Guerrero. Wear them all the time. And now we've got some Mick uh, Mick Foley socks. Oh, these are fantastic. Santa socks. And on the back we've got Saint Saint Nick. <laughs> Oh, these are fantastic. With that Cactus Jack this print down here. Wow. Awesome. Two Christmas related things uh, already. I like that. Very excited about that. And these socks. Always I always love a new pair of socks. I, I just I just do. I'm getting old maybe. We've got a comic book that's also Christmas related. We got Tales of the Road. Uh, it looks like it's probably uh, Mick Foley on the front because he's got Mr. Sacco there. If you didn't know, Mick uh, really, really loves Christmas. I think he has a house in a uh, house. He does have a house. I think he has a room in his house that's just Christmas like all year round. Like that's how much he loves Christmas. Uh, story by Mick Foley. So yeah. Oh, I bet this one's good. But that, but, but that one's pretty good. I like that. Love the tales on the road. I say it every time we get one in a crate, but uh, they are fantastic. The art's fantastic. The stories are great, uh, and I love comic books. So we have got uh, the only thing left is an autograph. Let me get it out here. We've got two. Merry Christmas to us. We got two autographs this month. This has been. One of my favorite months ever. Sure beats a yarmulke. I mean, that was pretty cool, but... First autograph. Oh, Scarlet! Look at that! We got Scarlet! That is a... Um, risque uh, photo. Um which I, I don't tend to put up, you know, <laughs> on my walls. But uh, she's a very beautiful woman, don't get me wrong. But uh, yeah, this is fantastic. Look at that. It's a great autograph, too. Fantastic. Scarlet's autograph in a pro wrestling crate. And we've got another one. Who did we get? The second one. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Yo. Is this the best month ever for Pro Wrestling Crate? Are you serious right now? That is amazing. Killer Cross, Carrying Cross, by the way, if you didn't know, uh, uh, husband of, of, of Scarlet, you know, she accompanies him to the ring. Uh, and then together, wow, wow, that is, that is fantastic, that is amazing, I am just, I'm actually blown away by this, this month, um, uh, if I, we would, if, if I would have gotten a yarmulke, 100% I would have put it on, <laughs> I don't know why I just said, I was just thinking, uh, yeah, if we got, a, if I got a yarmulke, I would have worn it, but, uh, because that seems like fate, doesn't it? But instead, we got some really awesome stuff. Holy crap. Two autographs, Scarlet, Killer Cross, comic book, some awesome socks, a couple of cool t-shirts. Yo, this was a fantastic month. I mean, fantastic. Uh, if you're a fan of wrestling and whatnot, I hope you got this one. This one was worth it, man. The, what is it, $29.95? That's crazy. Spoiler card. Uh, oh, next month we got Bruiser Brody, Dan Housen, Jamie H Jamie Hader. I was hoping for a Jamie Hader shirt. Uh, hopefully next month. Chris Hero, Braun Strowman, Jay White, and Shane Douglas. Braun Strowman, that's an interesting addition. Chris Hero I'm excited about as well. All right, what do we got? Uh, major Wrestling Figure Story t-shirt. Hustler, Hangman Adam Page t-shirt. Ultimo Brag... Ultimo Bragan. Ultimo Dragon Micro Brawler, 250 chase variants included. Uh, that was probably a cool looking one. Maybe a color, color swap. 
McVoley Headlocked Comic Book, Killer Cross, Autographed 8x10, Lucha Brothers, Babyface, Lapel Pin, 100 Chase Variants Included, McFoley Super Kick Socks, and Scarlet Bordeaux, Autographed 8x10. Uh, yeah, so using their independent names, not their WWE names. Uh, just got a text. Uh, but yeah, that was um, that was a great box. I'm not gonna. That's one of the best ever, if not the best ever. I it's I've gotten so many, and actually quite a few that I think were fantastic. So I don't know how this ranks with the uh, with the other ones, but uh, it, it's up there. It's up there. Uh, but that's it. That's all I got. Um, I hope that uh, you have a great holiday, great Christmas. Um, and uh, I guess I won't see you until next year. So uh, have a great rest of the year. And uh, have a, a great day, great week, great rest of the year. All right? And uh, thank you very much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, all that stuff if you want to. And I uh, hope to see you back again next year.